Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of Two Adventures. This is chapter number 5 I believe it is. We are going strong. We are keeping them around weekly but we've had a little break. We played some Phantom Forces. Last episode we escaped the cave. I am currently trying to find a new place to live. I've packed up all of our stuff. But then I came across these two wonderful dogs. Now I have said constantly how I want to get a dog. No idea what I'm going to call it yet. But... I'm gonna hope these five bones might just be enough. So let's let's give it a go. There are two. So we could end up with two dogs here. One, two. <gasps> we got half the two! That's amazing. Should we try and get the other one? We gotta do we have any like do these create pink dye? <gasps> I don't wanna oh damn it. I have no space in my inventory like at all. Okay, sorry gunpowder. I know you could be useful one day. But let's Let's give this one pink, and we can give the other one blue. This is so cool. I wasn't planning on recording yet. I was going to find a new place to live, and then um, see where we go from there, and then I was going to start recording. And then we're going to build a new house. Here you go, doggo. <gasps> we've got it after two again, and we've got one spare. If we come across another dog, and we'll get it after one, which is possible. How do you... Why is it not... How do you change? I just did it, but now it's not letting me. I heard a zombie. Can you not do it with this anymore? Do you have to like make the lapis? Oh, what is this? The, the hell? I don't like that sound. There we go. Come on then, fellows. Probably not the best time to get two dogs. Undoubtedly one will die and I won't be able to record an episode ever again. And I will cry for the rest of my life. Just readjusting my microphone. I literally just pulled out my microphone. And was like, oh my god, there's a dog. I have to... You can see, I've built a very graceful bridge to get to the other side of the ravine. That was our old house up there. I was sort of... I'm, I'm very, like... I'm, I'm very indecisive if I want to stay up in the mountains or if I want to go down low by the water. But I do also have the idea to like build a little house in like the in like that mountain there. But I also want to have a house that is like visible and like use the pink wood, you know, the beautiful pink wood. Oh my god. That was an amazing, amazing, amazing find. So I was sort of just wandering in this direction to see what we could find. Because I believe it's the jungle this way, even though we have just wandered into a oak and birch forest. But I don't, I've never been on the other side of the ravine. So I wanted to see what was here. See, there's a couple of jungle trees. It's a very weird seed, this. I mean, we can just keep going in this direction. Because I don't really, there's nothing in that area that really calls me, for Christ's sake, guys. Please be careful. <laughs> don't kill yourselves. Ow, I don't care. I will die before they do. Yeah, and it's just a bit interesting. But a bit, bit of an interesting episode this would be. Because it's literally just exploring, trying to find a home. And then we want to actually set up camp. Because we just had a little wooden box. And we didn't want just a little wooden box. I would say we can grab some cocoa beans. I mean, we can. Because we've only got... We've just only got one little space in our inventory. This is another, like... Oh, there's a melon down there. Oh, this. <gasps> oh my gosh. Did the dog just fall then? Or was that just my imagination? I just saw the dog fall. It could have teleported back up. But I'm not sure also if it was just my imagination or not. I really want to get those melons. Oh, we were here in the last episode. Because we were hiding in that little cobblestone. Guys, you you're really blocking me in here for Christ's sake. We need names. We need names for them. Talking about names, because this is sort of my discussion series, I need to discuss things with you. The thing is, the realisation that my, my my name, Haribo... Christ's sake, guys. Just kill yourselves. Don't do that. Um, My name is Haribo. So, I've actually really got to change that at some point. Because even though it's my nickname, unfortunately... No, I don't want a puppy! Oh, for the love of God. Um... <laughs> what? Oh, 
God's sake, we've got three. We've got three now. This is, this could get out of hand. I was only trying to get their health back up. Oh no, we're in a jungle. Never, ever a good time to be at night. I've got a bed on me, actually. I'm going to try and sleep. I can hear something walking. I don't know if it's a dog or a monster. Shut up, dog. <laughs> There's a pig over there. That's okay. I can appreciate the pigs. Daytime, please. Quickly. Yeah, anyway, as I was saying, I've got to change my name at some point. And I want to stick to the, like, the gummy bear sort of, like, feel. I want to stick to that because I like that is me, the gummy bears. But, unfortunately, I can't really... Ooh. Oh, now this is a good place to live. <gasps> God's sake, guys. You, do, you have no brain. Um... So I'm, I've been thinking either gummy. <gasps> so not a lot. I'm getting distracted by so much. I was thinking either gummy or chewy. I'm leaning more towards gummy because we've already got something called chewy, which is Chewy Adventures, the series we're doing right now. So I was leaning more towards gummy, gummy craft, because it just sounds like a like a nice name, and it's not copyrighted because gummy bears generally aren't copyrighted because they're just you know gummy bears they're literally just sweets but haribo is a brand of gummy bears so i can't really keep my name as haribo for very long especially if i get more views which is hopefully where we'll get one day more melons we're gonna go and get the melons now everyone okay swimming lesson swim just keep swimming yeah, so we've got to change our name at some point. I'm thinking, lean towards Gummy Craft, because I quite like that name. Gummy Craft, it's good, it's sweet, it sort of sticks to the same narrative. I was also thinking about Warabo, but I have no idea why. I think I was just trying to, like, incorporate wine gums and Haribo together. But I have no idea. I've never, I don't think I've ever had a wine gum. I get a shaking off. Uh, yeah, so Gummy Craft may come in the next couple weeks, but we're going to try and push a lot of more videos out because we want. I, I love filming these videos, I love editing them, but I want to maybe do a couple weeks of like two videos a week. I want to do a bit more Roblox. I'm going to, after this episode, I'll give you a little sneak peek. I'm um, starting to record um, a Retail Tycoon series. Ooh. This is a really nice place to live. It's like in a nice little, like, surrounded by mountains area. Which is really good, I think. We can, like, build, I don't know, a bridge over, like, to here and then mine up, like, a tunnel onto, like, the mainland. But this is, like, a nice little island. It's, like, surrounded by a moat. I like this place. Guys, we're gonna, we're gonna live here. I'm going to take a quick screenshot as well. You can see all the stuff that I've been on. I've been on Netflix, Now TV, and Disney+. Plus. I have such an exciting life. Not. I don't, I'm not sure about it still, though. It just it still, isn't, still isn't cooling to me. I've taken a screenshot for my coordinates. But should I go and have a little look further, or...? It's just a bit, you know, it's all right. But is there, like, it doesn't really give much, like, I mean, space. It's just an island, you know? Ow. Ow. So, I think we'll wander off in this direction. We'll leave the dogs there, because they'll be safer there than anywhere else. I probably should have taken the bed, but... I'm sure we will be alright. We're already, like, over ten minutes into this episode. We're nearly ten minutes into this episode, which is just absolutely crazy. These episodes go so fast. Got my pink wood. And my saplings. We need to find a suitable place for the saplings. That's the most important thing, making sure that the pink wood is happy. Pink wood is the best. We're going to build a doghouse now as well. Our pink wood doghouse. Pinkwood Doghouse sounds absolutely incredible to me. Mm -hmm. Scaling and mounting right now. I'm going to make a mess of this. Ugh. Parkour skills. Also, I want to start doing some servers soon. Because we're on bedrock. We've got 
We've got a few servers. We've got the Hive, which I frequent the most. Death Run, you know, Sky Wars, all that stuff. So I was thinking about doing that at some point. I'm really sorry, Pig. But unfortunately, you've got to die. Apologies for all the vegetarians. This is They're just ones and zeros. That's how I think about it. Just ones and zeros. There's more mountains over here by the looks of it. Baby sheep. I won't do that to him. Mainly because he won't drop anything. But Is there another ravine here? It seems like the ravine seed. Oh, maybe not. It just looked like it dipped down a lot more. Ow. My legs. Ow. My legs. Uh, there's no one really else around here. There's, a, there's another cave. I don't really want to do caves at the moment. If you saw the last episode, if you haven't, well, I don't know if not, why are you here? It's chapter five. Bees! I don't really understand how bees work. I know bees are in the game. But don't they do something for your crops? I won't do anything to them. It's a beehive. I have a feeling they get angry when you, um, if you hit them or something. I don't know if they drop anything. Do they drop, like, honey? That makes sense. Oh, there's two beehives. Look at the bees around here. I have a quick look over here, and if there's nothing here, I'm just going to head back, I think. Because I think we can work with what we found. Oh, there's a pillager tower there. I'm not strong enough for that yet. Yeah, I think we're just going to head back to where we were, and we can make that work. Because I've got, I've got somewhat of a vision for it already. I'm sort of imagining, first of all, I'm just imagining a nice bridge. Because I don't want to be swimming across to get to the mainland every single day. Because we need a nice wooden bridge, which I'll probably build outside of episode. And unless you want to see it, which in that case, make sure you comment it down below so I know. But building bridges ain't that exciting. Just as today, it's basically been a chit chat and exploring, trying to find a new home. But out of episode, I'll probably do a bit of landscaping. Shit. Excuse my French. Oh my holy lord. That was very, very terrifying. <laughs> if you haven't seen the other episodes, yes, I have already given a warning about my language. I will, if I fall down holes, like deep, deep holes, I'm going to say stuff like that. I don't plan to edit it out. It's not that bad. <laughs> oh, and I've lost my sense of direction now. I was... Is it just straight on? Oh, I had three hearts. That was terrifying. What sort of house should we build? I was watching TikTok the other day. You don't actually do. And there was this really nice house underwater. So, like, we have a river and stuff. So, I'm thinking we build, like, a really nice house on the island, which is right there. We found it. Um, and then we also, like, build down and have, like, basements. And we can have, like, nice, like, I don't know, like, a little bit of, a, like, an underwater part for all of our dogs. Can we? No, let's not even try it. I'll probably hit a branch or something. Yeah, we can try it from here. <laughs> Whee! Yeah, so... We probably should have set our spawn here. We didn't even click on the bed. That would have been a clever idea. How long have you been playing Minecraft for? Just over a decade. Oh, it doesn't look like it. This is a nice little place. We can, like, build, like, a nice little... I don't know. Somewhat. This could be, like, the doghouse. Obviously not just that. We're obviously going to build something nice for them. Yes, I promise we will. But we'll have our house on the top. And we'll have like a farm. And we can do some stuff with that mountain. Do something up there at some point. Yeah, the vision is coming through. And we've got like ocelots. We've got endless cocoa beans and melons. We have melons over here. So we can start a melon farm. I think that's what we should do today. We'll set up a little farm in the last five minutes. And then we'll call it a day. And then next episode, we will probably properly um get the vision started and start getting a layout do a bit of digging so maybe we should like dig down to like this level 
I mean, it's a lot of work to do in survival, but I'm doing this series 100% of survival. I've never done it before. Never done it with any other series that I've done on my, like, my old channels and stuff. So, I'm not cheating. Maybe that is a bit too low. But we'll, we need like a good bit of flat land. We're definitely getting rid of like these little top bits that are just completely and utterly useless. So, that's, that's where we'll be going. We need to place down some stuff. I don't know why we've got two crafting tables. But I think there was one in my chest and then I just had one. Uh, but let's... Let's get wood. And then we need a chest. If we just get rid of that a second. Oh. I've already got a wooden sword, by the way, because my stone sword broke at the end of the last episode and it was just in my chest. And I haven't been bothered to make a new one yet. So that's the story there. Do we have any? We've got coal, I think. So we need to spread out some torches. Because otherwise, monsters are going to show up pretty quickly. Um, 32 torches. That's enough. We just want so we can protect our children. We just, like, need this little... Like, this can be, like, our little cabin for now. Sorry, dogs. I'll build you something. I promise. <laughs> We're definitely going to need to start a tree farm. I'm pretty sure I brung some oak saplings. Shit. <laughs> Once again, how long have you been playing Minecraft for? And yes, I have OCD. I'm making it even. Leave me alone. Actually, am I going to be able to get out of bed in the morning? Or am I just going to suffocate? Oh my. Let's just get to bed. <laughs> this is just terrifying right now. Uh, I wake up in my chest. Nice. The greatest way to wake up in the morning is to wake up in my chest. Oh, for God's sake. I just want to... There we go. Oh, this is annoying. Where'd you look at that? Our little safe cabin. Let's put up some torches. Who needs roofs? You know, who needs a roof? When you've got a little safe cabin. The next episode, I think we'll grab some resources and maybe start a tree farm. Christ. Oh, well, thank you. You've helped me do a bit of landscaping, Mr. Creeper. Thank you very much. Do we really need a tree farm? I've literally just thought about that. Like, look over there. There's a lot of trees. A lot of them. We might be okay for trees for now. But we need to set up pink pink trees. Pink tree farm. That is that is a necessity. I'm telling you that. Oh, for the... I put my bed in such an awkward place. Is it like... It's when, when we've got it, actually. Um, can we... Why have I built such a tiny little cabin? That makes no sense. That will do. <laughs> um, What do we need? We need a hoe. We need a hoe. We also need a bucket. Oh, do we not have any more iron? We used it all up already. Oh no, we've got 24 unsmarted. Whew. That was like, that was like the entire progress of like the last two episodes. Just like 30 pieces of iron. Which is a bit annoying. We can make pink signs. God, Minecraft is honestly the best game ever right now. Just because of the pink wood. Okay, we've got a hoe. So if we go and get an unlimited water source, we can do just a little farm down here. This is nice. So if we just dig a little four by two by two hole a second. Then we can go down here and grab some water. Eh. Um, <laughs> one hell of a journey to get back up. There we go. 
Ooh, some nice arrows and a bow. I'll take that. Thank you very much. I have kids to look after now. I have puppies. Little puppies. Oh, this way looks quite a bit easier. <laughs> Trying to reach it. Well, I think this has been somewhat of a successful episode, really. We've got uh, a farm going. Well, we will do, anyway. Uh, we've found a nice place to live. Yes, I have OCD. I've expressed my OCD. That's That does not help my OCD. I just got dirt in my inventory. I did that. So if we do a little line of water here... It should work out, right? I don't know if, like, Minecraft farming has changed. I hope it hasn't. But, like, setting up a farm is essential. Because I need melons. Purely just because I need melons. Melons and bread. A melon sandwich. I actually want to go and try that now. I do love melons. I'm not overly keen on sandwiches. But I would try a melon sandwich. That sounds like something that could be revolutionary. Oh no, I've messed this up. Eh, eh, eh. So that still works how it does. I think if we do another line of water here, then we just do a little bit of digging on the other side. Do we not have a shovel? I don't have a shovel. Please don't shout at me in the comments. And then we can do just a little bit of mining there and we can get a good couple rows of wheat and melons. We are 22 minutes into this episode, so we'll have to finish up in a second. I think I'm going to film another episode straight after this, so I won't do any landscaping between now and the next episode. But between the next one and the one after that, so between chapters 6 and 7, I will do quite a bit of landscaping and resources gathering just like lay out a basic template of the house now have a little think about like what sort of design we want to go for if we want to go for like a modern or if we want to go to like a classic minecraft house or like a lighthouse or or if you want to suggest anything down in the comments feel absolutely free to love to hear any suggestions as always Perfect. I'm going to grab some seeds from the house and then we can finish up. It's been a good episode. We've at, This is actually all coming together now. I mean, we're a long way off facing the Ender Dragon or the weather, but we'll get there one day. Oh my god, we've got 64 seeds. Goodness. Where are all my melons? Oh, there are the melons. Uh, I think we need to craft the melons into seeds. Yep, there we go. Craft them all into seeds, because, you know, why not? The Minecraft music is very loud, but it is also very epic in my headphones. It's incredible. So we're going to do melons in the middle, and we can do wheat either side. Oh. We do a couple of pieces of the wheat there as well. Even though that hurts my OCD. Okay. And that's... That's today's episode, guys. We've done quite a bit. Next episode, we're going to... I'm not quite sure what we're going to do yet. But I think we might lay out a basic plan about what we're going to do. I'm going to have a little think between now and the next episode. Which is, for me, about 30 seconds. For you, it'll be just over a week, if not a tiny bit more. Please tune in to chapter number 7. If you haven't... Chapter number 7. Chapter number 6. If you haven't watched chapters 1 to 5 yet. This is number 5. You should definitely go and check that out now because they are all amazing. My favourite so far is when we found some pink wood. No surprise there. Thank you all very much for watching, folks. This has been Gummy Craft on Chewy Adventures, and I'll see you all very soon. Thank you very much, folks, and I'll see you all later. Cheerio!